there. My name is Shauna Bernardin and I'm here with Global Groomers and I'm here to give you some quick tricks and tips. Today I'm going to be showing you one of the hottest new fans of the world right now and that's Asian Fusion. And this is our little miniature schnauzer Bijou. I can't wait to show you some awesome tips so today. Just like in every good haircut, we're going to start with two good baths. I actually love this absolute red. I wish this was smell vision because if you could smell how great it is, it's amazing. But it's also really nice on the dogs, really gentle on the hands, super important. And on all schnauzers, give their beards at least two really good scrubs, maybe three. They're always dirty. We're back with little Miss Biju and her Asian fusion. I just love this little girl. A couple of different things. Uh, we have her modified just a little bit. Her face is completely fusion, absolutely. But typically on a fusion dog, they're gonna have a longer leg. She lives in the country. She goes for lots of walks with her family. So we have scaled her legs down. And a lot of times in uh, Asia, when they're doing the fusion, they're using the number seven blade or a number 10 blade. I live in a country where it's minus 30 right now. So I've scaled that up and I'm using a number four attachment on the back under my wall Rivera. So you do want to be sure that the, the body is fairly short. There's a contrast between the body and the legs on the fusion, absolutely. With the bevel, because they're always, always requesting bevels. So like I said at the beginning of this, we are toning her bevels down a little bit. Typically in fusion, it's a much bigger leg. But just to show you guys, now remember, her toenails are already cut. Her pads have already been done. I'm just using a nice little round Japanese shear, and I'm just clearing the foot underneath and I'm making sure that I'm not going into the top of the foot. That's the most important part. Then I put the foot back down on the ground. I'm just going to use a little mister, spray it, and I'm going to comb it in the direction that I want it to go. And then I'm just going to take my round scissors again and I'm going to meet the two lines together. If you guys start to work in this fashion, you're going to see a huge improvement in your bevels in a very short amount of time. I follow these rules every single time. Okay, so now we're at the part where everybody wants to know all the tricks and trades, okay? Fusion faces. First of all, just remember one thing. Fusion it means you guys get to have fun. You're going to make mistakes, understand that. You can do a bunch of different styles on a schnauzer. She's had long ears before, she's had shorters. I kind of like her to have a shorter ear and so does her owner. Uh, one thing that I love about her, she's got these beautiful long eyelashes. So I'm always super careful with that. So I'm gonna just bulk it out a little bit and I'm gonna use my lavender attachment with a number 40 blade on my wall Rivera. And I'm just gonna tip her head forward and I'm gonna take the top of her head off with this. And I'm sliding it just over her ears. I don't like her ears as short as a breed trim schnauzer. I'm gonna tip her head back. I'm gonna take this off. Remember one of the Key things about fusion is the front of the face is generally very short and you always want to make them smiling. I'll be back and I'll scissor it up with now, you. All we've done on her face is clear the corners of her eyes and bulk in her head with the A attachment. So now I'm going to over direct her bang line. And one thing that I do just to save those eyelashes because they're really beautiful, they're probably hard for you to see right now, but you will see. I just hold it underneath my thumb and I over direct her bang line. I'm going real carefully. I don't go up straight. I want to put a little tiny bit of a visor on it. So I'm going to be at 45 degree angle. And honestly, slow and steady always wins the race, you guys. This is not an area that you want to be rushing. I always do these parts with love. So once I've cut my bang line in, I just set it up. I go back and finish that after. I'm going to comb the face up to the side. And I like to use these chunkers on this particular part. And I'm working in a circular fashion. I'm just going to pull that ear up. You 
can see I'm just working this way. So here we are at the end of this little Asian fusion on a miniature schnauzer. Uh, I think the key points that I want you guys to remember is first of all, have fun. Fusion is a lot of fun. Secondly, you cannot, honestly, I keep going over her little face with these little thinning shears. That's really what makes the difference. I hope that you guys are gonna have some fun doing this. Just to recap, she is in a little bit of a modified Asian fusion. So what we did on her, on her back, we used the wall number four blade with a 40 blade underneath the attachment. And then on her face and her legs, we used the lavender. I really hope you guys are enjoying these videos. We are having a blast doing them. Thank you guys so much for all your subscribes and likes and shares. If you guys are liking them, please share and then subscribe. Have a great day.